Good afternoon, friends. This is Sanjay Agarwal. I'm here at Gandhi Nagar for the Deaf Expo 2022. This is going to be inaugurated by our country's Prime Minister Shri Narendra Modi Ji tomorrow, 19th October. Yesterday on the 17th, we had the Defence Minister Raksha Mantri Rajna Singh Ji along with the Defence Secretary and uh, Jo Mukhe Mantri. Uh, Gujarat, Bhupendra Bhai Patel. So they had a curtain raiser and they had a press conference. So we are right now sitting at the HEC venue. Uh, this is today's the 18th. And I have the gentleman from Polo Microsystems Hyderabad. He's Mr. Sai Ram. Sai Kumar. Sai Kumar, yes. So Sai Kumar ji, I want to know about your company, what are you into, and how do you feel to be part of the Deaf Expo? Um, good morning everyone, uh, my name is Sai Kumar, um, uh, this is Apollo Microsystems, uh, we have been uh, participating in the uh, Defence Expo for last more than 10-15 uh, years. Um, this is a very prestigious event and happening in Gujarat, we are very happy to be part of this event. We as a company, we develop uh, technologies for uh, defence platform, uh, maybe a missile systems, torpedoes, aircraft ships and submarines, we develop uh, onboard electronic systems for them. And we also develop some platforms like uh, mines and we also supply LRUs and subsystems for you know indigenous torpedoes and various other weapon programs. It's a uh, three and a half year old, 30, 35 plus uh, years old company. Last 37 years you know we have been in this field and um, uh, we are a public listed company uh, listed in both the stock exchanges of in, uh, the country. You have your MD Mr. Reddy. So, uh, he has background is uh, what, engineering sir? Yeah, he is a, a, a graduate and uh, after his graduation he has started this company as a board design services company. Then slowly up to a platform level we have grown this company for the last uh, 37 years. Okay. And what about your, like uh, when we are talking about skill, manpower, you know today in India we have skill, manpower, our uh, focus either in the defense or any sector is about giving jobs to the uh, various uh, students across the country who are taking different courses. So how many people are you employing and how many women? Um, more than 35% uh, are women employees in our company and we are very proud about it and uh, it's almost around 300 plus workforce you know work in this company actually. Right and since you said it's uh, about the missile systems so we uh, means it is understand that uh, you're giving it to ISRO and all whatever is happening when even I think our uh, former Prime Minister Atul Bihari Vajpayee had launched those you know and then we have the PSLV and everything so what are your future plans and are you also into exports to any neighboring countries? So you brought out the point very nicely so uh, late Sri Vajpayee has started the Pokhran test and uh, we have given a big voice to uh, the entire world that you know we have the capabilities and we can nail on it and subsequently as the years passed by and with all the latest uh, government initiatives as well make in india has been a very big uh, super hit i should say and um, we have we have shown the world that you know we can develop technologies and today we are trying to show the world and we have already shown the world that you know we can also export our technologies and the platforms that we have built and we are very proud that we are part of this uh, fantastic ecosystem and i was just wondering i am watching the video on the left hand side which is playing so I saw you in your younger days <laughs> and uh, I also was wondering uh, the name, the Apollo. So uh, you could uh, tell us more about why Apollo. I have got something in mind why <laughs> Apollo because Apollo was one of the you know vehicles which landed on the moon. Absolutely right. You know, um, when the company was started, okay, the first generation entrepreneur, Mr. Karuna Karedi is the founder and managing director of the company. So uh, initially the company started its journey with Department of Space. So and he wanted a letter which should start with A and he, um, uh, Apollo is uh, um, uh, I think the it's the best name that he has chosen that you know it uh, something like a space mission because our journey also started with space missions actually. So that's how the Apollo has come and you know um, and now we are a brand by ourselves. Yeah, because I actually uh, when I was just reading Apollo then it occurred to me because uh, I am one of the fortunate uh, persons when I was young, small, you know, as a child. So I happened to see Neil Armstrong in Mumbai, Bombay those days, when the first uh, American thing landed on the moon. So actually Neil Armstrong, just uh, by a second, uh, he was lucky enough to step on the moon. And you know, that time Soyuz and Apollo 
and so I think we are uh, talking with the director of a futuristic company and uh, if India is going to hit the you know targets what the Prime Minister is out to set so this is the place you should be watching for thank you Sanjay Agarwal at Gandhi Nagar thank you, thank you.